Amazing. Now we've just had some issues with the fish in this tank so I went and tested the oxygen um, literally as I was about to walk out because looking at this tank it has excellent surface agitation it has a very good skimmer and it's right next to a window which is currently open so I would never have guessed that this tank had low oxygen yet I've just tested it two times and one time the oxygen level came out as about three and the other time it came out as below three. So we really want an oxygen level of about eight. So an oxygen level of three certainly has implications on the fish. So any time that you have issues with your fish, even if you think that you know what the issue is, it's really worth checking the oxygen. So JBL make these oxygen test kits so it would be absolutely worth getting one because I have learned that you cannot tell what your oxygen level is by just looking at it. You absolutely have to test it. So things that we can do, increase surface agitation sort of is not an option in this case. Um, it's already got a skimmer, so that's not really going to help us. The things that will help, um, opening the window more often is gonna help. And the other thing that we could consider doing is putting an ozonizer on it because an ozonizer is going to um, raise the oxygen level and the other benefit of the ozonizer is it's going to kill any sort of parasites like white spot and helps to reduce algae and helps to ensure that your aquarium is nice and crystal clear and healthy as long as it's run on an mv computer so you don't raise your ozone too high and create a second problem. So an ozonizer I would only use with an MV computer. Anyway, if you have um, played around with oxygen tests before, then make sure you put a little note on the bottom of this video, any lessons learned that you might have or any suggestions you might have.